Good afternoon, Rochester. This is Mary Lovely Moore and me, her daughter, Taylor. We understand that there are some challenges that we're experiencing as a community and, and literally as a country. And having our children at home all day uh, together, we decided that we would share some of the things that we do when we're home together, and that is really science. Taylor loves science, and so that's why we have the goggles, the gloves, and the jackets, uh, something that we do on a regular basis. But we thought that during this time, we could share with you some of the things that we do for fun, and you can share with us some of the things that you do for fun. So if you love to dance, or you love science, or you love to color or do art, then show us and so that we can try that, and we'll do this together as a community. Because in Rochester, we hashtag rock together. We also have a news channel called What's Good Rochester, and we're going to be posting these videos from you, from myself, from other people all around uh, our community because we're all at home together. We're experiencing these trying times together, but we also want to make sure that our children have a fun and loving experience uh, during this challenge time. And so today, as we said, we're going to be using some baking soda. All right, so Taylor is going to pour about one third cup of the baking soda into uh, the measuring cup. And you want to have, of course, a, a cup that you, or a glass that you can use as the volcano. And you want to have a base. So you want to have something that the uh, bubbles and the, the mixture can come out into. And um, you also want to have gloves and some eye protective wear and something to cover up your glasses, uh, cover up your clothes. Uh, today, I think that that is enough. So baking soda serves as the base. And of course, the vinegar is the acid. And what will happen is once you mix the, the base and the acid, you will create a carbon dioxide gas sort of explosion. Uh, the 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 uh, carbon dioxide gas will push up and you'll see the bubbles come out and we will have created a volcano. So why don't you pour that in there, Taylor? All right, that's great. And so we're just gonna get the rest of the baking soda out. The rest of the baking soda out, yes, okay. And we're gonna rinse this out so that we don't create an explosion for time. All right, grab some paper towel there. All right, and why don't you pour a, a cup of vinegar in our measuring cup and we will see what happens next. As I said, if you have some food coloring at home and you wanna add a little bit of food coloring to change the, the mixture color, you can do that. We don't have any at home. And so this is truly about what we already have in our uh, possession so we don't have to go out to get these items and let's see what happens so when you pour the vinegar woo! <laughs> you create an explosion it's a gas a carbon dioxide gas explosion and this is some fun science that you can have with products that you already uh, have in your possession at home thank you all for joining us we're all in this together we realize that it's challenging times, but we also want you to know that we are rocking together in our homes and creating opportunities for our children to have great, fun, loving experiments. We know that everyone is a little bit scared right now. We're scared as well, but we're in this together, Rochester. Let's go, Rochester! I hope you liked our video. Now we would like to see your take on what we just talked about. So please hit the link below to upload your video and maybe next time you'll be featured on What's Good Rochester. Also hit subscribe so that you can get up to date information of when we're posting videos. And thank you for watching.